Welcome back to Focus on Arts. I'm your host, Patrick Van Slyke. I'd like to thank you for joining us today. And once again, we have one of my good friends and a great guest, um, Stephen Whitrock. Stephen, thank you so much for being here with us today. Thank you, Patrick. It's always wonderful to see you. And we have school starting pretty soon. Can you believe it? Mm, it's hard to believe. It is. Yeah. The summer's almost over. and it's. Are you ready for school to start again? Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready. Um, I've been in, I've been having a great time in the summer. Yeah, take catching up, catching up on some uh, cl extracurricular classes that I hadn't taken, and, uh -oh. and ready to go full force in the fall. Right, and yeah. you know, and it, it, correct me if I'm wrong, but you did some traveling this summer, didn't you? Yeah, a little bit, a little bit of work involved, uh, a little oh. bit of traveling. Okay, uh, I know you were in San Francisco. Yeah, right. Yeah, yes, I was. Yes, and and. Did you go to Mexico for a while? No. No, okay. Where was the zip line at? The zip line was last year in Mexico. Oh, that was last year. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So just San Francisco this summer? Just San Francisco this summer, yeah. Uh, and it was for work? It was work and related, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, and how was San Francisco? Never been there. Oh, it's really nice. It is. Uh, I'm, gonna I'm surprised you've never been there. Yeah, no, I've never been there. It's very I'm nice. Going to have to make it up there sometime. Well, let's talk about um, recently, just recently, or not so just recently, I, I uploaded um, The Bishop. Um, Thank you. Your movie. And before I did that, of course, I had to screen it because I'm not putting any crap on my channel. And I was really, really happy with it. I was really for, for you know, for not a lot of resources, not a lot of time, and not a lot of experience, I thought it was really excellent. Thank okay. you. Yeah, so tell us something about, tell us a little bit about the process that went through it. I know yeah. you were the one who came up with the script, isn't that right? Yes, sir. Okay, yeah. so tell us how that went. Well, I wrote it, uh, directed it, cast it, and uh, I refused to act in it, uh -huh. but I, that's why I, I got actors for it, uh -huh. right? And when when you make a movie, um, you see, I see a lot of different, when I watch it, I see a lot of different things that I wish I had done a little bit better. Oh, sure. Yeah, you see that, yeah, I, I was, I was um, editing it and doing the mastering, mastering uh -huh. of the sound for it. Uh -huh. And so one of the things was I was watching the opening scene I had a lot of different ideas for the opening scene, mm -hmm. and uh, so I used some B-roll for the actual for the actual opening for, right. the, for the for the very first image right. live image you see that transitions to uh, it's a picture, but mm -hmm. it's supposed to be the exterior, the window of the it's supposed to be the window of the right of, of the, the palace, right, right. That was an excellent transition, and I and I'm an editor, so you know if I say it was good, it was good. I was, Thank you. I was like, wow, you know. So you've really come a long way as far as editing has. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And do you still have that jalopy? <laughs> uh, <laughs> the jalopy. It's it's a hand it's a hand cranked <laughs> hard drive. Uh, hard drive. <laughs> <laughs> that unless you, unless you crank it at the right speed at the right speed you can't yeah, save any right. you can't save any vi video that was horrible wasn't it it was horrible that was that was i think our first lesson in you know if you're going to do something you got to get some at least halfway decent equipment halfway decent and i've already yeah. i've already rectified that yeah I've, right i've already gotten a, yeah so a new but the fact that you were working with such a hard hard drive to work with and the, and then all the other pieces you put together let me ask you this did you film in, and probably not because there was two two locations so you didn't film in chronological order no okay no so you just did what you had to inside and then you did what you had to outside or the exterior was the the first stuff we filmed okay because one of the uh, actors wasn't it uh, isn't in the uh, Television film department. Oh, I see. So he had a, he he had to do other things. So we only had two days with him. I see. So we had to get all the days that he all the shots that he was in first. done first. Right. Okay. And then the beginning of the film was done the third three days of shooting. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it was on the third day. Oh wow. And the first the first shot like a the transition from the 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 exterior to mm -hmm. uh, the interior the palace. Mm -hmm. Uh, I was looking at it, and I, I got some re I got some recommendations and some criticism from it from other film 
from other uh, classmates who were saying that there's a term called water hosing. Okay. I hadn't heard of it. Right. Where it's basically the camera is like moving around like a water hose. Mm. And I was look and 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 the friend was saying, you know what, you, you, that that interior shot, it's water hosing it. Your water, it, it's not a, a smooth. It's not a smooth transition. I see. From the window to towards the characters, oh. it's a little bit of a, a l little bit of wiggling. Okay. So that that th those are the things that I s I notice. Right. I notice every little thing. Yes. That 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 could possibly every detail that I didn't like. Right. Yeah. I mean that's what yeah. a creator does. So yeah. what caused the water hosing? Was it was it just the camera wasn't locked down correctly on the tripod? Or? Well, it was it was just the 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 pan the panning of it being from from a higher altitude. I see. Down to a lower. I see. So it wasn't a pan at the a same straight, yeah. a straight pan. It, it was, was a pan, pan plus a tilt, right? A pan plus a tilt and I I'm not very good at that. Okay. So it was it was it was a little Okay, right. Yeah. yeah. That's one of the reasons smooth. that's one of the reasons that I, I don't do my own camera work is because I'm just not steady enough, you know. And there are people like I found um, we just recently did a one minute a one minute movie. I liked and, it. And this girl, um, Cheyenne, she's got the steadiest hands. It it was it was remarkable, you know. But that's the neat thing about film is that it is a collaboration and you need all different kinds of people, you know. And so you find somebody who's great on camera, you find somebody who's great in post-production, you know. Pretty soon you've got a team that really can put something neat together. So so what's what's next for Steven? What's coming up? Well, I'm glad you asked that. And I really did like your, your short film. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Thank you very much. Um, the next thing I'm working, uh, I'm going to be working on a, tel a, a short teleplay. Okay. W working with a three camera, three camera uh, setup okay. tele inside the television studio uh -huh. over on campus. So I'm going to be wor I'm working on an idea right now based based on some. Um, my idea is based on some Chicanos. Oh, okay. Some Chicano uh, Americans. Uh huh. Uh, Probably in take t t take place in the 70s. Okay. And have a little bit. I, I want it to be a comedy. I oh. want to do a comedy. Okay. Based sort of based on like some gangbangers, but not gangbangers from current day. Right. Gangbangers from the 70s. I gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. And so that will be something that uh, is going to all take place inside. Yeah. Okay. All right. Will you do you will you use different sets inside, or is it going to like take place all in one room? It's going to take place all in one room. Okay, so it's going to be live. So it oh, okay, so it's going to be very uh very dialogue driven. Yes. Okay. All yeah. right. Have you started writing it yet? No, I haven't. Okay. No. So you're just putting the ideas together in your mind right now. Yeah. Okay. All right. And are you a senior this year now? Yeah. Okay. So yeah. you're you, and you're going to be graduating in spring, right? Yes, I am. Are you and you're walking, right? Yes. You plan to walk. Yes. So, are you excited? Yes, I am. Okay. Yeah, very excited. And and we had talked about this, and I think that you were unsure whether you were going to be looking into the MFA program or or not. Is that still sort of in the air, sort uh, of? As a matter of fact, I have been looking at the MFA mm -hmm. <coughs> seriously. Mm -hmm. And there's a couple of schools that I'm interested in. Oh, um, okay. If I can't get into some of the public schools yeah. for the MFA, there are a couple of private schools that I'm thinking about. Oh, wow. Uh, the New York University in Los Angeles. Oh, my gosh. New York Film Academy. Okay, yeah. New York Film Academy in Los Angeles. They film on uh, the Universal set. Oh, my gosh. That's wow. a possibility. Oh, wow. And um, also LA Film School. Mm hmm. That's over on Sunset Boulevard. That's a lesser, that's a possibility, but it's. Uh, I a see. lesser choice. Right. Yeah. Right. Now those uh, at, at private schools are expensive. Yes, they're 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 more expensive. Okay. Forty forty thousand and wow above. Yeah. Wow. So you're going to prostitute yourself? I mean, what are you going to do to get that? Money? <laughs> I'm gonna rob a bank. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. oh. Okay. Got it. So yeah. um, so but no, you're gonna get help from your parents to. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
get help from uh, get help from my parents. Your family. Yeah, from the yeah. family. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's really neat. Yeah. And is that like a you're ninety percent sure you're going to do that, or are you going to wait until you graduate and then kind of see how you feel, what comes your way, or? I have to get I have to get the ball rolling. I uh, I want it to be as as close to a uh, hundred percent possibility as right. as possible. Right. Because I have to. I really do have to do something. Yeah, and we have to. If we're going to MFA, we have to start applying. I mean, the application process starts now. Yes. You know, a year before. So, yeah, I have to get work busy working on it as well. So. Um, but the other possibility is if I can improve my GPA. Mm -hmm. If I can improve my GPA in the time being. Yes. Uh, that's where your help comes in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Uh, if I could improve my GPA, uh -huh. uh, then I could go to a public school. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah just stay at Cal State where you know all the teachers because it's, al it's always easier to stay at the school that you're at because yeah. they already know you and so on. So, yeah, I'm, I plan on staying at Cal State. I, I am going to put in an application to... Um, to um, CSU, just in case, you know. Which CSU? Um, well, I'm sorry, um, USC. 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 Yeah. USC. Yeah, just in case, just in case. Mm -hmm. But uh, they would have to come up with a huge financial aid package for me, or else I wouldn't be able to do it. You know, that's a great just, idea. Yeah, that was your idea. You said with your grade point average, mm -hmm. apply to a whole bunch of places. Yeah, I think I recommend UCLA. Yeah, you did. You yeah. did. But then you also said you could do USC as well. So right. So, or right. CSU, I can't remember which USC one USC and UCLA, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to try that, just see if they, you know, if somebody can come up with financial aid that makes sense. So, so I'm going to look into that. Well, Stephen, it's been wonderful having you again. Thank you're, you, Patrick. You're dressed fantastic, just like normal. You know, you're looking great. You're looking healthy. Thank you. And we're going to be starting school again, so I'm sure we're going to have a lot more to talk about real quickly. Yes, we will. Okay. Yeah. Well, thanks again for thank being you, here. It's always a pleasure to see you, you, just like just like always. And we want to thank you once again for joining us here on Focus on Arts. Again, my name is Patrick Van Slyke. I'm your host. Thank you so much for joining us, and until next time, be safe. Take care.